Hey guys, what's up? How you doing? I am Frank James Bailey. Welcome to my YouTube channel and today I'm going to give you another cartoon review. Today I'm going to cover a cartoon on Cartoon Network and that cartoon is OK KO! Alright, how long do I have to stay in this position for the thumbnail? How about we start the intro right now? OK KO, Let's Be Heroes is a superhero comedy animated series created for Cartoon Network. It's based off an original pilot called Lakewood Plaza Turbo, originally aired May 21st, 2013. The star of the show is, of course, KO. He wants to become the greatest superhero. He also works at Gar's Bodega, a superhero supply shop located at Lakewood Plaza Turbo, owned by Mr. Gar, a serious, dedicated manager. Alongside KO are his two best friends and co-workers, Edid and Rad. Even though the show is called OK KO because the show is about KO, I think Edid is probably the breakout star of the show. She is the most responsible of the main trio, even though she is kind of lazy. She tries to use logic and critical thinking to make her rational decisions. In case I didn't mention yet, She's also a witch. And it's never said, but it's implied that she's probably bisexual. And I say this because, one, her hair is purple like the bisexual flag, and she used to have a thing for Rad. Also, her and her childhood friend, well, they may or may not have had a thing, or maybe they're just best friends. Anyway, Edith is one of the best characters on the show. The other main character besides OK is Radical, so everybody just calls him Rad. He appears to be boastful and a slacker, even before getting his very physical, bulky physique, he was kind of cocky. And because of his personality, he ruined his date with Edith many years ago. And like I said, all three of them work at Gar's Bodega. Mr. Gar is shown to be a very strong character with an even stronger personality. In most of his appearances, he can be seen with a cold and serious face. He's extremely serious about his business and the plaza as a whole. About the only thing that changes his personality altogether is when he's shown to be with Carol. Now, who's Carol? Carol is K.O.'s mom. Yeah, this strong guy just turns to jelly when he's around her. One of the main villains of the whole show is Lord Boxman. He always sends robots across the way to destroy the plaza. All right, now that I gave you the basic info about the show, let me tell you what I think of it. First, the good. There is some drama, some conflict. There is lots of humor. Personally, I think too much humor. The animation is very original, but... Honestly, that's what turns me off about the show. So let me get to the bad stuff. Again, the animation is very original. It's very different. But in my opinion, it looks like a child drew it. I'm not saying it's a bad show. I know it has lots of fans. Getting back to the good side for a second, the characters are phenomenal. I love the individual characters and how they grow. I love that idea, and I love the storylines. But to be honest, I can't get past the animation style. It just looks too clunky to me. Compare the animation style to Miraculous Ladybug with CGI animation. That looks real. Or even something as classic as Kim Possible. They looked human. They looked real. These guys look like they're drawn by a child who's maybe 10 or 11 years old. Again, it's original. I like the idea behind it. It just looks too, I don't know, clunky to me. All right, enough rambling about what I don't like about it. Let's get down to the score. On a scale of 1 to 10, 1 being the worst, 10 being the best, I give OK KO a 5. <laughs> Please, if you like the show, don't be hating on me and putting in the comments, oh my god, you only gave it a 5, blah, blah, blah. Again, this is my humble opinion. It's just not for me. Like I said, I love the idea behind it. It's just the animation style is really hard for me to grasp. And the other thing is, I've only seen half of the first season. I haven't seen any of the second season yet. So maybe I'll change my mind somewhere down the road. But as of right now, I'm only giving it a five. If you like this video, or if you're a big fan of OKKO, OK please give this video a big thumbs up. I'd really appreciate it. Plus, if you really like the show, or if you don't like the show for some reason, please leave your comments in the comment section below the video. Let's talk about OKKO. OK Let's be heroes. I'd love to hear from you. That's all for this week. Thanks a lot for watching my video. I'll talk to you next week with another cartoon review. That's all. Bye-bye.